another one. And so today I'm going to show you guys how to get the Russo Sword of Truth booth. And I'm doing it on my old account because I already have the Russo Sword of Truth on my main account. So why not? If you want to friend this, eh, this account, if you out, out the name is jailbreaker underscore 200. And make sure to leave it a follow because it's me. Okay, so I'm just going to build a little boat, oh, mostly because I'm on my alt account and I don't have any of my superior building materials and stuff, so I'm just going to launch my boat. So basically what you got to do is you got to go, you got to go to the waterfall right near the edge right near where you got to start doing your stuff so it's like you got to dodge some of these rocks and in the, and then this waterfall this waterfall you can jump out of your boat uh, right here and you'll be good you, you won't die so then you got to go inside of here Uh, and usually the door would be a uh, the door so this was already here before the the RV battles update so there's a certain code you had to type in and uh, and with these books it's it's yellow red and pink cyan and then lime green and then this door will open. And as you can see, you could just claim this thing right here if you want. I don't know what the heck it is. You could just claim it if you want. And then the next code is down. <clears throat> now here's the next code. Yellow. Red. Purple. Beige. Orange. Green, black, purple, black. And then, once you come back in here, uh, there will be a cannon starting to fire out clues to where... to where... to what the code is. <coughs> but here's the thing, we already know the code, so you don't have to do that. <coughs> And then stand right here. Stand right there. And the floor will start to go out and you're in this weird laboratory thing. So what you gotta do first is make an R. Wait. Yep. Just like that. There is no, this is the only right way. You guys could take a screenshot. Uh, you, want, you guys on PC, you could take a screenshot. I'll give you a sec, pause the video, take a screenshot. Okay, you good? All right. So now the B, but it's inverted. So you gotta do this, all of this. You gotta make a three right here. Then make two, and make one here. And now take a, take a minute to take a screenshot of this. Just pause the video, take a screenshot. Okay, you good, you good, you good, okay, good. Okay, now in the center you gotta do this, this, this. You gotta... So you gotta make like uh, like those things, and then in the center, put make a straight line. Then over here, and then make a sword that looks like a sword. So guys, takes guys, you can roll the vi video back, take screenshots, uh, just copy me, you just do all that. Uh, now you gotta go down here and pull this lever, and then your FOV will start to uh, increase. And then this portal will open. Now, uh, you gotta wait a second because sometimes it bugs out. And then you can jump in. And I can do this boss battle on my own. So, it may take, it to, uh, may, may take a minute to teleport you, but boom. A secret play. It should teleport you to a secret place by Chill Studios. 
and now we'll say you win and the sword will be right there and you can take it and win just kidding there's a boss fight just kidding there's a boss fight And then you gotta do the boss fight. And then you'll just throw some obstacles at you. Oh, they'll get harder and harder. If you die, you'll just have to start over from the beginning. But at least, but at least there's like, so there's no health bar on this thing because you gotta do it at the end. There's something at the end that you gotta do. So, this one is easier than the one in Shark Fight. This is definitely easier than the one in Shark Fight. Right, but that's easy. It's worse. It's definitely easier than the one in Shark Fight that I showed you last video. Oh, where I almost, where my Roblox crashed and I thought I could get in and all that, that raging stuff with the mean credit scene. And all that stuff. Just, just. And now, after all that happens, it'll be like obby stuff. I suggest looking up. I suggest if you have a mouse and WASD, I suggest, I suggest looking just like up and down. And now, there's a double, so you have to jump on one of these things. So you gotta jump on one of these things. All right, they move, just so you know. They, like, they're not the same spot every time. So then there's some more. Then there's these two at the back. Now, what you gotta do for this is jump off. And I didn't do it in time, so I have to take damage from that. And then they just gotta dodge the lasers because now they're on a mini platform. And these are actually the hard part. So, this is actually the hard part, believe it or not. This may seem easy because there's like a minimal amount of square. This is the part where I usually take a lot of damage off. Alright, and then he heals you because that's the end of it and now just start jumping left and right like this now the reason so if you guys are wondering in game when you're doing this boss fight uh, you're probably like why is it only following me because it's local it's following everyone on every everyone's screen it's just it just so it's like following everyone but it's local So now I suggest just looking upward, or for this one. Oh. Just gotta say, just look, like, gotta, just gotta look. This is a really cool boss battle. I, I really enjoy this boss battle. Every time I play, I, every time I replay it, I get a lot, I enjoy this boss battle. So now, here comes the hard part. Hard. Your amount, the amount of area you get starts to decrease. And usually, I never really liked boss fights up until the, um, uh, the boss fight in the Despicable Me obby. The, those were really awesome. Shout out you Shovelware Studios. Cause you guys are awesome. I am doing a series on the um, uh, on Shovelware Studios games, a roleplay series, Shovel, uh, Shovelwire Studios games. I only have two parts out. Alright, this is the hard. You think this is hard? Well then how about this? Just gotta keep... Just gotta keep going left and right. And then... All of it will come back and uh, it'll start to heal. So now I suggest staying in a corner because he is going to try to smack you with his hand. He's going to try to slap you with his hand. And so you gotta take a, 
out the, the least amount of chunks possible. You gotta take out the least amount of area possible. And you can take out the least amount of area as possible. Because once he's done doing that, he's going to start punching you. Oh no, more. Just try doing it at the back this time. Is this it? Gotta take out the least amount of land possible. I did not do a very good job. Now it's local again and he's going to try to will punch you. And you gotta move to the other side, quick as possible, all to do that. Yeah. Slap you again. Now there's a self-destruct in that up here. There's, and you gotta hit, make him hit it. There's a, that self-destruct button that appears. Make him hit it. And then, then there's this awesome, crazy ending. He explodes. The re short fight boss battle. Well, does have a backstory to it though. We don't know why this robot wants to kill us. So then when the white fades, when the white screen fades, he will have the sword of truth inside of his hand and you can go take that. You will, and you will also get 200 it gold. Now this is a starter or person and I'll probably never use him again ever unless there's another unless there's like other stuff so guys i hope you all enjoyed this video make sure to leave a like subscribe to the channel turn on notifications so i'm gonna go back to build a boat equip this sword on my character on my alt account character i gotta go equip my sword on the alt account character i gotta look also, I, I honestly think the Sword of Truth is, I honestly feel like the Sword, I like the Sword of the Truth, I like the Sword of the Truth, mo most others, there's my, you guys might have different opinions, and now here it is, my, uh, my spare account having the Sword of Truth on, here it is, you're seeing it boys. The spare character having the sword of truth on. So, you guys, hope you all enjoyed this video. Make sure to leave a like, sir. And subscribe to the channel. Turn on notifications. See you all next time. And Plasma out.